Ahead of the G20 Leadership Summit in New Delhi next month, the Australian Minister Tim Ayres has expressed optimism and satisfaction about the evolving economic ties with India. Echoing India's call for reforms at the World Trade Organization, Ayres emphasized the shared responsibility of the G20 ministers in leading the reform effort. Navyon Sidhan Sibyl spoke with the Assistant Minister for Trade, Lisbon, to what he had to say. India and Australia share a strong relationship with me is the Australian Assistant Trade Minister who is here in India for the G20 Trade Ministers meeting. Let's talk to him about this relationship and about the G20 meeting. Sir, welcome to Vyond. My first question to you is uh, how was the G20 Trade Ministers meeting in uh, Jaipur which took place and also there are concerns over weaponization of trade if we can talk about that. Well, I'm very pleased to be here and to be here on your program. It's a very big question. <laughs> the, the agenda in front of the G20 trade ministers is, uh, is a complex and important task. And I, I was very grateful for uh, Minister Piyush Goyal's uh, efforts in, uh, first of all, India's excellent hosting of this G20, but also in encouraging uh, the trade ministerial to focus on the issues that matter as we approach the WTO trade ministerial in Abu Dhabi early next year. That's going to be a vital trade ministerial for the world uh, as we make sure we rebuild confidence in the world trade organisation and rules-based trade, as we uh, resolve some of the key trade issues that go towards the economic challenges that the globe is facing, the climate and energy challenges that the world is facing, uh, and also the key food security challenges that the world is facing. Trade is an important part of the answer here. Uh, and India's leadership in, in focusing the ministerial and the discussions on the issues that matter uh, was very welcome indeed. Um, so, uh, India has been calling for reforms of trading bodies like WTO as well. What's your take on that? Well, we share uh, India's view uh, that, uh, that reform is required at the WTO. Uh, there's been excellent leadership by the WTO Director General uh, Ngozi Okonjo Iweala. Uh, and there is a shared task in, in front of the G20 ministers to lead that reform effort and to build consensus around making sure that the dispute settling mechanism has the confidence of all of the countries and economies engaged in the, uh, in the WTO. Well, thank you so much, sir, for speaking to Vion here in Delhi. And perhaps there will be more engagements and, of course, the upcoming visit of the Australian Prime Minister to Delhi for the G20 summit. Thank you so much, sir. Thanks very much. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.